the Hop Garden Handicap. This next this is a Class 7 0 to 70, and it's over a mile and a half again. And we've got Pepperoni Hose at the top four, CDJ Liggett, Deputy Bill for Stu Gray, Paul Letter, Alex Cherry, Outlander, Martin Leedham, Ars Life, Thomas Rogers, Minigal Melody, James Shea, Him Lizzie, Thomas Rogers, Shaken Mirasol, James Shea, Actionable Obi Wan, and Take Me On Obi Wan as well. So Obi Wan will be over a bit more luck than he had in the last race. Uh, ten of them this time, and the draw shouldn't be all that significant with a mile and a half to go and only ten runners. And they're all quietly installed and ready to go. And away they go. Outlander closest to us was out pretty smartly, so too was Mini Girl Melody. With a shaken mirror on Deputy Bill a bit slow to go. But they're racing up the straight then for the first couple of furlongs of this race, and it's ours of life who's gone on into a clear lead. From Outlander second, Paul Letter on the outside of that one is third. Then comes Minigale Melody, and then Actionable in the, the first one in the yellow jacket. The second in the yellow jacket is the only grey in the race. That's Take Me On, and the chances of me calling that Take On Me before the end of the race are pretty huge, I would have thought, especially if the race gets exciting towards the end. But it's ours life in the lead then as they head out on the complete circuit of the track Outlander is five lengths down in second Paul Letter is behind that one in third gap of three lengths then to Pepperoni Jose for CDJ Liggett then comes Minigal Melody Deputy Bills after that him Lizzie is wide on the track actionable and take me on all together and Shake and Mirasol is pretty wide on the track at the back but it's ours life who is clear in front by four lengths to Outlander in second and then Paul Letter third. Pepperoni Jose is just showing fourth. Get that on this near side mini girl melody. Right over on the far side in the similar colours is Shaken Mirasol. And the same colours again. Here Lizzie is just a back marker. But it's Ars Life who was in the lead. Leading by a good two lengths to Outlander in second. Paul Letter being pushed along in third. Then comes Pepperoni Hose on the outside of Minigale Melody, then the great take me on. He's starting to move forward with a nice run up the inside. If can take advantage of it on the wide outside there, shaking mirrors on Minigale Melody trying to get there as well, but it's now Outlander who's come through the challenge for the lead, and Outlander has hit the front. Outlander's quickly got a length clear then with two and a half furlongs to go, and Outlander is in front from R's Life in second. Paul Letter is back in third. Then comes Minigale Melody and shaking mirrors on, then comes Pepperoni Jose trying to get into it as well, but Outlander's in the lead with a furlong and a half to go, but they're queuing up the challenge. Outlander's in front. Here comes Paul Letter, shaking Mirasol, and Pepperoni Jose and Minigal Melody inside the final furlong now. Outlander is trying to stick on in the lead, but Paul Letter's trying to close. So too is Pepperoni Jose. Outlander's in the lead. Here comes Pepperoni Jose, and Pepperoni Jose is going to get up and take it, and Pepperoni Jose takes it. Outlander stuck on for second. Him, Lizzie, finished fast in third. And. Pepperoni Jose for CDJ Liggett, who I'm pretty sure had one disqualified rather earlier this week or last week, so that makes amends for that. Outlander held on for a second, just got no fight that one. It's all right if it stays in the lead, but Pepperoni Jose wins it for CDJ Liggett. Outlander second for Martin Liddham. Him, Lizzie for Thomas Rogers was third. Paul Letter for Alex Cherry fourth, and Take Me On for Obi-Wan was fifth.